Alright everyone, it is Crimes of Chaos here and I am playing some Forge Quest. When we last left off, we finally opened up the frozen gate that I was a bit confused at at the beginning of opening. So we finally figured out that we had to get a dragon to uh, melt the, the surface ice on the gate, which then caused it to open. Wow, I got that on the first try, I think. Uh, did I? I think I did. Yep, looks like it. Okay, so we are now in the second level of the ice dungeon. Here, getting close to the boss. I remember, I think we went down seven or eight levels in the last dungeon. So we have quite a ways to go. Um, now with all these new puzzles that have been added in the latest update, it uh, it should it should be fun. It'll uh, be more interesting now. Um... Wait, did we already do this? Or do we have to go farther? Oh, <laughs> there's a some sort of dinosaur wolf thing that's frozen. And I remember there's something we can't attack. Um, that being a problem. Uh, I can't remember what it was, but I remember it being something that we couldn't attack. This thing doesn't seem to want to die. I'm kind of a bit worried if we can't really get any progression. Also, my hand, my left hand is hurt, and my finger on my right hand is, <laughs> is the nail is sore, so playing this is really difficult, actually. <laughs> my hand hurts every time I try to move around, so I might make a few mistakes here and there, because I'm in pain. Um, I feel like we really need to go back to the shop and figure out how to do this, because <laughs> running around trying to... Oh, wait. We did do this then. We did do this, so... Do we have to go up, or...? We, I'm going backwards. Let, let's go back to the last room. Huh. Okay, so it's going down. Oh. I am useless. Oh, my headphones, my headphones feel so much better on my head now. I just got a haircut today, so I had so much hair on my head that I freaking think the headphones dropped about two inches on my head. That, I've had to literally make them, you know, smaller to fit my head. I had so much hair on my head. I usually leave it for a couple of months just to grow it out and stuff, but I left this way too long. It was like a forest. It was like... 500 pounds of hair on my head Anyways, I got rid of it now, so that's good and that is a witch guy I thought we were gonna talk to him, but no he is a bad guy and he wants to kill us so I really hope that the boss isn't someone that has to require those um, a weapon in order like I don't get how to kill those that dog thing I really don't like I guess it's something special I'm gonna assume that we're gonna have to buy some sort of fire potion or something from the store how did you even get me some silver we're definitely getting close enough to we're definitely getting close enough to forge our own items. And I remember we needed a couple pieces of silver, I believe, or some, we needed something to complete it. But I remember being very, oh, is that a dog that can't die? Nope, it's a, it's a dog that can't die. Not that I would like to kill dogs anyways. Um, they're really cute. But unfortunately, he's a, a death ice dog of some sort, so we're gonna have to kill him anyways. What is block shift? Okay. That makes it a lot easier because I was not sure. I have not played this game in a while. I have Hexit coming up. I said that a bit weird. I have another episode of Hexit I'm going to record. It's been a while. A couple months, I believe. If I remember last checking the videos on my channel. Voice crack. Ate those. Just gotta live with them though because, you know, can't really stop them. These things are vicious. I'm gonna stay away and use my bow. Ooh, 
Wow, my accuracy is terrible. Hit him! Come on! Oh my... Okay, well, it looks like I'm just gonna have to go... Like that. So there's two keys now. This is a very easy puzzle. I don't know if this was supposed to be difficult or not. You obviously just do this. Just watch it be some little catch and I just look really stupid. But if it is as easy as I think it is, then this isn't really a puzzle, it's just a roadblock. Nope. Push it in, there you go. Yeah, come on, that, that wasn't hard. That wasn't a challenge. More of these crystal mini games. I don't think I'm going to play it with it uh, because I have quite a bit of crystals anyways. I think I have something over like 200 um, dust particles or whatever you get from winning the game or at least completing most of it. I always hate when you get stuck and don't complete. I depleted it like three times and then the other five that I've done are just, they're just a nuisance and they, they stop halfway. There's nothing I can do. Am I going somewhere, or is this just a dead end? Looks like just a dead end. Pointless room? Yeah, pointless room. No. Let's kill this guy, just for... old times. So that opened up a pointless room. And this room too? I don't I don't know. I couldn't tell I wasn't able to see. Unless this is where we came from. This is probably where we came from. Unless <laughs> God damn it. I'm gonna feel so stupid if I go back. Whatever. Here's some undiscovered stuff, so it looks like we haven't been here. These guys are really easy to kill. And this is the second dungeon. I, these are easy to easier to kill than the bats. And the bats were really bad. I hated those bats. My arch nemesis. Oh, there's a heart. Collect that and on our way. I didn't know we had 103 HP. That's good. We started off with 50, so we have improved quite a bit. We've got a lot of, uh, what do you call them, abilities now. We have the tri-bolt, or how many bolts does it shoot? Five, I counted. And we have the mega smash thing. I'm just naming off stuff. I'm not really, I'm not really paying attention to their real names. I'm just being stupid and trying to figure out a name that sounds cool. That hides the fact that I don't pay attention to what I've collected. Yeah, that's, that's what you get for being slow, man. Gotta be quicker that if you want to beat me. Alright, so we are down to the sec uh, third level, I believe, now. I do, though, notice that they do quite a bit of damage, these guys. They they compensate their, their um, ability to be killed. Oh, I went down. I thought the game crashed for a second. That freaked me out. Ooh, key. Nice. Repair tool. That's nice. Er, let's see if we can embed any runes into our equipment. Equipment. Apparently, that's a word now. Is there any? Nope. Cancel. Cancel. I don't think there is any other rune slots though, so we might just be out of luck. Do we have a ring equipped? I believe we have a ring equipped. Ring of ranged weapons, right, so that does suit us. Ability of damage. I think we're just going to keep that ring. Because we have our trusty sword and our bow. And I'd rather have our bow at a better damage rate than damage rate. Whatever, I'm just making up words. I'm just 
I'm gonna create my whole vocabulary of words I use to cover up the fact that I don't pay attention to <laughs> the lore of the game, the, the weapons and stuff. When I just see a weapon in Skyrim, I probably just describe it as a sharp metal thing. Oh, would you look at that? It's a sharp metal thing. I can equip that. Not paying attention then, it's something worse than what I have on. Again, another, another puzzle that won't take too much time at all. What's the other puzzle? There was, oh, the click, the, the square things. What, what you gonna call it? All right, actually we should move these first. There we go. Oh, I didn't know you could move it sideways from that angle. That's nice to know. Back it up. Unlock one. I hopefully we can push two at the same time. Nope. Of course not. Why would you think? Why would you think that they would allow you to push two? That's just cheating. This guy would have to be pretty strong. All right, nice. We are making quick work of this dungeon. Now I believe it's that door, but like the last room, I don't want to miss out on a room that takes us the right way. Yeah, I believe this is probably the right room. These guys, those guys are really easy to kill. Oh, no, I thought I had the right combination for a second. Nice, just in time. Try this one. Oh, yeah, it's the right one. Please, oh, good. Thank, thank God. Keep going. Health. Definitely need that right now. Okay, let's see who has better aim. Me or the dead skeleton? And aha! It is me, even though I, I suck. I think we can almost end the episode. It might be short, but my wrist is starting to hurt and I really don't want to- Oh! That? Are, those are the chickens from the boss that we battled last time, so I'm kind of getting a bit anxious here to see if we're actually on the verge of going to a boss battle soon. And if so, that'll be awesome because then for one, the dungeon- Oh! Big room, possibly. No, just a hallway. Don't get too excited. But I feel like there's something coming. Okay, let's go down. Something's coming, I swear. You have discovered a portal. Awesome. Oh, we, we leveled up, too. Sweet. Uh, um, where's range? Wizard. Nope. Mage. What is the... Here we go. Rogue. Okay, so... What's this? Buff gives each attack 60% to apply poison attack. No. Do more damage with your ranged attack the further the enemy is from you. Um, okay. Let's, let's spend it on that. Sure. That's good. And do we have one more? Probably not. Okay. Let's get on with it then. Going down, oh. No, I get too excited for this stuff. I swear. Is that a chest that's gonna kill me? Nope, that is not a chest that's gonna kill me. That is a awesome chest, which is gonna give me 
tons of loot. Oh, there's that yellow dog thing that is impossible to kill. Really gonna have to uh, research that uh, and see how to maybe at least get around them. Uh, hopefully that is not a creature in the boss battle or else I will probably be stuck on the boss battle and not able to move which I really don't like when I get stuck on a boss battle because of stuff I can't do uh, then then you have to spend time grinding to get them item and then the game doesn't become fun because you wanted to do the boss battle in the first place and you gotta wait oh god <laughs> uh, did not did not realize I was on the verge of dying I'm being surrounded by little squishy things oh my god Freaking out here. You little guys are tough. Energy bow. Ooh. Energy bow. Let's check out the energy bow. 29 to 35. Why does that tell me? Why does that? I don't. Uh, never mind. <laughs> bow. Can I see the stat of the bow? Please? What, what do I have equipped? Did, oh, here we go. 23. Oh, okay. Well, it looks like we are equipping the energy bow then. <laughs> Ooh, it has a socket too. Rune of Ambition. Mana Max. No. Gold Find. 18%. No. Health on Kill. What does that mean? Health on Kill. You gain... I'm only gonna assume that that means you gain health when you kill the enemy. Okay, let's let's test that out. Let's let's test our theory out. We're gonna complete this puzzle uh, because I know this is the trickier one, so it might take some time, and we'll probably end the episode because I don't want my hand to feel like I'm putting it through hell. So let's find the keyhole first. So that we know at least where to position. Is it over here? It is, but there's those blob things. And how did that dog get... Oh, God. If I have to complete this puzzle with that thing on my ass all the time... Oh, it can teleport. Oh, wait, wait we can hit it? I don't even know anymore. <laughs> I don't even know anymore. Okay. I feel like we can do this. Hold on. And up. Oh, oh, I see. I see. We're going to move both of these to the side. Perfect. Oh, wait. Not perfect. Uh, shoot. What we're going to actually have to do is... Um, damn. I did not account for having space in order to move it. So I don't... Oh, we can. Haha. -ha. Okay. So we'll do the further one first. And then all we have to do is slide the key right in. No, I'm a lot better at this than I thought. I'm terrible at puzzles on other games. But uh, for some reason, I get these puzzles a lot easier. Probably, for one, they're not that hard. And for two, I mean, oh, we're going to end the episode now. All right, guys. Well, you can like, comment, and subscribe. It really helps me out. I know I have been talking a lot about new games I'm going to try out. I know I've been talking a lot about it. I've been, at, um, I've been trying to get you guys hyped for it. And then two weeks later, still not a single new game. I'm just... I'm kind of nervous about recording it. I don't know how it's going to turn out. But uh, anyways, I I'm assuring you that there will be an episode out within the week, possibly um, tomorrow or something. I've got to uh, see how much time I have to record. Anyways, this is Crowns of Chaos, and I will see you guys next episode.